Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to our forecast. Today we thought, why not spice up things a bit? And instead of showing the weather forecast as is the tradition, we instead show the monthly forecast of a typical salary earner. We start with the first days of the month. Let's just take the first week of the month. And as you can see, these days are scattered with very high traces of excitement. And this excitement tends to manifest through stupid statements that a typical salary earner will say because he has just been paid. Stupid statements like, you can keep the change. Stupid statements like, oh, you don't have to pay me back. Stupid statements like, I will drop you. Sometimes even the person being given a free ride kindly turns down the offer. And it's like, I stay 18 kilometers away from where you stay. Just drop me at the pass park and I'll get a bus. And the salary earner will be like, can you see my fuel gorge? I'm on full tank. If you go to the home of a typical salary earner in the first week, in the first five days after being paid, you might see the unbelievable. You might find pizza that has been thrown in a trash can and on observing the pizza, only one slice was eaten. Why be so wasteful? They will reply, something was just off about this pizza today. I think maybe they put a lot of chili. Moving on to the second week of the month shit starts to get real these days you will see a lot of traces of being moderate with yourself and with your lifestyle for example a salary earner in the second week if they go to a shop to buy just a bar of soap and they have very little change that they're supposed to take back home they will ask for a seat and sit down for two hours waiting for the shopkeeper to move around looking for change if she did not have it this is a symptom that shit just got real. Also, transportation undergoes reform. Days have to be chosen where they can drive to work and when they can use public transportation like buses or cheap taxis. With men, they become so sensitive with any suggestion of spending. For example, if a beautiful girl was to tell them, can you send me some money for transport so that I can come and see you? Just that asking of transport will turn them into men's rights activists on Twitter with hashtags and giving transport to females. For women, in the second week, they exhibit a lot of weird behavior. Compared to the first week when they are moving around, catwalking and happy, in the second week we start seeing things like weird behavior. And moving on, in the third week of the month, we can literally compare this week, which is the week that is just preceding, the week of payment. The salary earner is at a bare minimum. We can compare this week to Jesus carrying his own cross to Mount Golgotha. This week is full of traces of confusion in the salary earner's head. With things like trying to borrow money from strangers, you don't want to smile and wave at a salary earner in the third week. Chances are they will laugh at you and end up saying, you have some money you can help me with and I pay you next week. For ladies, they try to WhatsApp their rich ex-boyfriends or the rich men they rejected, hoping to string them along until the next payment. WhatsApp starts to change. All of a sudden, you see last scene at 6 p.m., and they are again online at 8 a.m. That's the only time they are around free Wi-Fi at work when they are home. They are not really on internet. And lastly, as they are approaching the payment week, they all make to themselves that promise that is always a lie. That next month I will plan better only to repeat the cycle. Thank you for watching the monthly forecast of a typical salary earner.